It was it was a really good ball game. I think we saw a, a ton of different things, but um, we really needed a good start from Joe Ryan, and he gave us exactly what we were looking for. Uh, gave us six innings. Um, we stretched him out a little bit. Um, threw the ball really well. Uh, you know, sending him back out there to, to face those guys again. I mean, he was. Uh, he looked very comfortable and still at ease even late in his outing. Um, our bullpen was fantastic. Our, our defense was very solid. Um, the plays Gio was making, I mean, those are, those are crazy plays, fantastic plays. Uh, and plays in a tight and tight ball games like this that they're a big reason why you win a ball game, you know. Um, and overall, you know, it was a, a tougher loss than maybe normal uh, last night. But to be able to come back and show up and, uh, you know, good energy, well-played game, it was a good day. Joe, I think specifically, like, struggled with walks. I think he had a career high five or something the last outing. Just to see him be able to clamp down on that, how promising is that? Yeah, that was just mentioned uh, coming in um, after the game. I know his command was excellent uh, today, but I didn't realize there were no walks. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Exactly what we're looking for. Nice adjustment by Joe. Uh, but no, I mean, from, from the get-go, he looked, when I say he looked comfortable and at ease, I mean, he was uh, very much in control of the outing from the start. Um, and he catches pop-ups, too, which is pretty cool. Do you, do you, are you aware of the deal he gets? I've heard about it. <laughs> I've heard about should, it. I don't know. Try to get in on that. That's it. He's. You know what? Uh, yeah, we have we have a few deals uh, over here, a few carrots and enticements um, that float around. But um, that that's a nice one, and uh, we're not going to rein him back yet. Uh, if he wants to go catch a pop up that that you know others are struggling to get to, so be it. Well, he. I think he said he could have doubled it. He tried to get another, but Jeffers called him off. So tough scene. I'm glad we're talking about this. It, me it means the game went real well, and then we can move on to the uh, you know side wagers and things like that. Buck slams it in to the wall. What's going through your mind as you had hadn't played him, and obviously are trying to keep him as healthy as possible. And that was a pretty um, a pretty Buxton like play to go as, as hard as he could in that chain link fence. Yeah, um, we keep a close eye on him. I mean, honestly, that's that's really you know. All I can say, you know, our eyes are on him. We're, we're going to make sure he uh, uh, just gets up. I mean, it is part of the game, too, to, to be able to go out there and try to make plays, and he is one that will always uh, want to try to make the play. Um, you know, the way he spun off the wall was a little, you know, interesting is definitely not the right word, but it's, it, it, it definitely caught your eye. Um, but he seemed to get up fine and, and make his way back to center field fine. I, I honestly... Um, didn't see much issue with the with the play and the way he went back and, and carried on in the game. Um, I think he I think he was fine, but uh, he's he's kind of a unique talent because you know you watch well when kind of I mean very, uh, but he makes his way towards the wall and he's kind of cruising, but he's still at a pretty high rate of speed even though he's not close to going all out. He's still moving pretty good. So I just think he hit it a little. Um, uh, at, at some sort of uh, different angle, and it just caused him to kind of spin off the wall. I, I think he's okay. I think he's fine. Is that 